Welcome gamers to another Wild Peace Ball Trash video. So today we're looking at uh, Bello Betty once again, but in a different method. But I have a lot of thoughts about it. Like you guys, she's like hate dining the bunt, re bunt first Ben for this month. So she is a character that many of you all are getting. And I would say she's pretty good. But as you can see there, when you don't have your skill one and you are below 50%, well, no, like you don't have your skill one, you just get stunned. You can't keep attacking the launch. And the problem with that is, as you can see, the skill 2 cooldown relies on you, you know, to keep hitting your opponents and them not getting those perfect dodges. So you want to, you know, stay alive and be at 1 HP constantly, you know, keep buffing your allies with uh, the skill one. The skill one, as far as I, like, I have used it, it mostly benefits the uh, the attackers, right? I've not seen other Roger players when you boost them benefit them. Like it doesn't benefit them. But Zoros, when I see them, I legit go to them. Shanks, same thing. You know, other attackers, the ones that can just even Cracker, Alba. Like when you power those characters up, or King when he uses his skill too. When you power those characters up, they can do a lot of damage. Which you'd want. Yeah, we, we couldn't get enough hits there, and once our skill 2 ran out, uh, Roger, you know, pretty much can KO us. So, the fact that uh, Beno Betty is like the 1 HP, you know, survival type of thing, similar to the Light Order, that means we can do a couple of things to make her more usable in League. The first thing is like uh, the EX Roger Pirate support. That, or X Roger Pirate support. See? That support, you know, with the Roger Pirates and everything. And another problem is that when she's fighting off a Roger, she is feeling the gauge so slow. And that, okay, we just got stunned because our skill one is done. But this problem can be addressed. The support, of course, will help you, like, once you're below 50%, it reduces the status by 30%. But you're not only going to need that. You see, on this gameplay, we're using a, you know, double battle. They are about to metal set. It's good for skill 2, but it lacks skill 1 cooldown. But you're not gonna get, you don't want skill 1 cooldown because his skill 2 will help you survive if, you know, there's two Rogers coming at you with a Kabasari and doing all that damage. But as you can see, like, you think we're not contributing because we've been stuck the whole game uh, uh, on spawn, yeah. But yeah, one thing, like, with the medals, I would suggest the blue out uh red defender queen and the page one metal yeah well the red defender page one this one i think it would be pretty good there's some skill too like when you're down and then skill two cooldown with uh the queen medal and then the ultimate medal i consider the most important medal bruh you need to upgrade to that 70 percent stun reduction because roger can catch you so much out when your skill one runs out uh, 15 seconds like, when you see Roger running like that, you use your skill one. Because you don't want to, um, <laughs> well, get stunned off. The fact, say, 15 seconds is too short, you see? And one other thing, when you knock back opponents, it takes longer for them to get up. So, you know, that's going to be a problem. You see, now I have to watch him take the flag. That's not what we want. I, I, I could take him off the flag, but when I touch him, I'm going to get stunned, you see? So you, once you have that support, that EX Roger Pirate support, and the, the stun reduction medal from the ulti medal, then you will be pretty, like, looking pretty good. 100% stun reduction, you know, stopping them, like being able to hold the flag, you know, similar to gear 5, then you do good. I uh, hear we were playing a little bit of, uh, you know, cowardly, so he can't kill us. He, he managed not to kill us, so we can get our skill too. Yeah, we hit him a couple of times and then we got our skill to back, which is nice. Yeah, you can keep hitting Roger, bro, when he's running. Because even if he hits you, you're not gonna die. And you want to get your skill to cooldown back. Mm -hmm. 
You're nice. Sensual AI. We back away a bit there so we can get the skill 2 back. Then we use the skill 1. Just, just to get that attack buff. But yeah, he, the healing is so annoying. Like Sometimes it's hard to kill, like, kill all these Rogers because they keep healing. That trait, uh, when you're a damage dealer, it hurts you so much. Like You need to be able to deal fixed damage. Similar to Zoro, this one. Or you just one shot like a V1 Roger or Full Red Jakes. <laughs> That's the difference. You can't be like, keep healing this Roger uh, and then hope to kill him. At this Full Red Jakes, even though he heals him as well, but Full Red Jakes is taking away his HP so he can boil it down to zero and then I kill him, of course. This is how it goes. Even if you don't use your skills to one shot him. So, yeah. And all of these gameplay, these games I have, right, the good games, I was not using that defender support I mentioned, and I was not using the EX or the Pyro support, I was not using the ultimate. This was just, you know, max red support. Um, you know, the performance that everyone will get when using it. But I feel like you can make her, you know, a lot better. Once, you know, we have those medals ready, um, it will be pretty good. Like, that, those medals... They can make Ace and Yamato much better. Because Ace and Yamato, they su suffer from Tremor for Whitebeard. The stun from Roger. This stun is the, absolutely the most toxic, the most broken thing they could have ever done in this game. Because it ignores obstacles. Even if you're not fighting this Roger, bro, he can slap you from all directions. It, it, it's so annoying. But yeah, these two games, they were the good side. So where we were able to clutch. Now we move on to. Well, the negative ends. I don't know why we boost uh, White or well, we boost White Beard because we, Roger is coming here. But this White Beard, I mean, I tried to help him, you see, but he doesn't want help. He, di he didn't want help, and he's eventually gonna die. Like, let me attack him. Stop, 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 stop downing him with you, with your no no. Bro. But he doesn't want help, and I don't have like the leave it to me stem, so I left him. Look at it, bro. I'm trying to help you. These people, bro, you stun me. Like, what? What? The, what's the point of you? I was going to give you the stitches notification. This, this type of place, bro. I just move, use my skill tool, and just run away. Let him die. Let him die. But yeah, like, your skill one can get interrupted like that. That's one of the negatives with it. And once it does, you can be fooled. Like, you know, Roger can't kill you. Yes, when using skill two, but you need to hit him. You need to hit him to get your skill two back. Once you don't have that skill one, it's dead. This is what you don't want. And then yeah, like if I had that EX Roger support there with the ultimate up there, Roger wouldn't have not been that much of a problem. Yeah, that skill does so much damage. <laughs> like especially to defenders. Gear 5, like I love boosting them as well, but they don't do enough damage for some reason. Even in the attacker form. Like, they don't take advantage as, like, for Fulmer, Shanks, Cracker, and Zoro. Those ones, when I boosted them, they can they dominate and tear through the match. Yeah, Bello, like, I enjoy that, but, you know, I've noticed a lot of, you know, flaws that could be improved on with the metal shenanigans and the support, but, yeah. Not many people have the uh, EX Orange Pirate support, or six of them, or they have the, you know, that rainy uh max because you need him max and the that's the free to play shanks everyone has a mix 60 days you play this game you have that good defender shanks mix so yeah but you need the dark rainy that's from the roger banner to be max because he needs to be put down there in support so you can get the, you know, those two defenders and the four defenders can be uh non roger pirates because there's only two roger pirates that are Defenders, mm -hmm. and we just got the second one like just now. They're all attackers and brothers, of course. That gear five is annoying. Like my team, look at that. How are we gonna lose this one? Oh, that uh, that beef leg. If I noticed sooner, I could have helped that uh, kid and law, but I was filling the gauge, which I shouldn't have been. There was no th danger, and then yeah, we lost. I mean, this is how it goes, but you're gonna see a much worse match than this one. Yeah, but all you need to know is that uh, the the dumb teammates can send you at times. Mm -hmm.
they can sell. Yeah, you need to use your skills carefully. So we're on that variety map again. You're gonna see like this game came to me uh, not having that. Uh, or having to use my skill one to, you know, not get stunned and everything like that. I could have stopped Roger and kicked him away without doing that and you know save the game. But you'll see. So we're kicking away, we're doing zero damage because like he has 80% damage reduction on the flag. So I'm saying, yeah, gun. I like to call him a uh, gun fall actually. But yeah, gun fall, yeah, he's there, he's good. But you know, still we to heal block and um, you know, fix damage that Roger does. So, yeah. Even if he nullifies the stun, that's not good enough. Like, you need to be able to deal with, um, yeah, that's fixed them. Because Gunfall is not immortal like Middle Bad or Light Order. So, yeah, oh, death. Yeah, that, that's a one shot. You run out of skill to clean uh, the punish it in time. And I don't think, yeah, we, yeah, we wait to use Beno yeah. Didn't uh, somehow edit this out, of course. I think that was the only time we died. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the match is going, like, chaotic. The Rogers is dominating. I think they have four Rogers in the enemy team. But we're gonna get this flank back, I think. No. Yeah, oh, the Roger was at sea, he was capping. And we're getting this flank back, yeah. Yeah, the, the Rogers are just, you know, dominating league throughout me. Like, uh, you need to, you know, use an upgrade and get those standard action medals because they are the ones that uh, dominate the meta. It was the same when Whitebeard came out. You wanted a thermal reduction so that you could be able to fight Whitebeard without, you know, having to worry about, oh, I'm getting tremor and everything like that. I thought we were going to win, but, uh, well... Things still went bad because of this Roger move. I look at that, it's like a two or three seconds longer time from being downed. And I wish uh, Be Bellos Nomos were much better, man. They're like. Yeah, that. Oh my gosh. That is so annoying. And then he does this. Terms, look at this. Like, if I had standard reduction, I could have stopped him. And this could have saved the game. If you think about it. Yeah, he dodged this. Oh, man. If we dodged that, we could have stopped him, right? Yeah. That was also a misplay from my end. But look at this. We stole the game. Because we don't have the proper medals and everything like that. So I hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay the video. Better Betty is good in the meta, but you need to take her to the next level. To be more consistent with her. See you guys in the next video.